say hi guys welcome back to my mom's channel She's 14 months and I'm also going to be showing you guys her Love Everly box. Obsessed with every single thing we got. She's so obsessed with the box. We actually have to keep the box because if she doesn't see the box, she will start crying. Um, so that's fun. And then we're also going to be organizing her nursery, maybe moving it around. I have no idea yet. So let's go in her room and kind of like pick up everything. I want to change the theme in her room so badly. I just don't like the whole, I still like the rainbow theme. It's just not her anymore, I guess you could say. Let me show you guys what her nursery looks like. Okay, this is her nursery. She like, the theme in here is kind of just like rainbow and pink. I don't really know, but then her birthday was once upon a time, so she has like the little crown stuff. She has a castle over there. She has her tent. She has this that says once upon a time. Really, I would love to make her theme once upon a time with princesses and stuff. It's just, I don't really know where to start and I don't know, because this is really just where she plays and she has a lot of books and all of her babies, but she doesn't really play with her babies that much. And then she also has her kitchen, which she loves. She also has her Love Everly section, I call it, because it has these amazing like toys right here. Then we have the box that she plays with every single day. She has some crazy toys in here, like her shovel, her like little basket, her princesses, her like little phones in here. And then in here is kind of Love Everly stuff and some like blocks um, from the Disney like block collection. And Moana's in there too because she loves Moana. And then yeah, her kitchen's right there. So I was kind of thinking moving her crib against that against the window over there and then I don't know maybe moving this I don't know I don't know this is really heavy so I don't know if I want to move that I definitely do want to switch these photos out I just have to kind of like make a plan on what I want to do with them yeah maybe I'll just pick up for right now in her room I'm also giving a box of toys to Sam so he can have some at his apartment in South or North Florida. Um, and yeah, so she has toys over there to play with. Um, also, I don't know if I showed you guys these photos. I added our photo for my birthday of us. And she says dad, dad like every single morning. She loves that photo. And then this is when it was fall and we went to like that ranch. That was really, really fun. Maybe if I move this over here and move the rocking chair over here, because I kind of just like want this whole section to be like her play area. Let me try and do that and see what it looks like. Okay, let me vacuum over here and then we'll see like what is all this stuff I feel like this does not fit in the space maybe if I Okay, so I just called Sam. He loves it in here. However, he thinks because I think this looks like a little crazy to me He thinks that I should like switch these two 
So I'm gonna try that and see how it looks. Cause I don't know, this just looks crammed to me. Maybe if I flip this on its side, like that, so it's like that one. Let me see what that would look like. Okay, love, love, love her little bookshelf. I added some of her like babies that she doesn't really play with anymore just because I feel like she would grab them if she saw them. Normally they're in this like random bin. She loves this like empty container wipes. This is another Love Everly toy. I love it, Love Everly. As you can tell, we're so lucky that they send us stuff, but we love everything that they give us. Now this disaster normally goes into her little house thing. So let's organize and then figure out what we're going to do. Okay, I was thinking maybe if I took these pictures and put them on the side of the window. I just, I don't know. I don't know what to do with these. And then maybe hang the once upon a time like right there. I don't know, or should I just throw the once upon a time thing out? I think I should just throw it out because it does kind of look cheap and it was cheap. <laughs> I just thought it was really cute. But that's okay. We will get rid of it. Say bye bye. I love it. Okay, okay, I'll show you guys. This is what it's looking like. This is what it looks like now. And then that kind of stuff I just like need to put away. But now I think I want to organize these drawers. They're pretty organized for like the most part. Like I don't need to organize this. This is all like her bows. Maybe I do need to organize. Okay. That's all of her bows. And then I have, I have diapers in this one. I've always had diapers kind of at the top because obviously I use them the most. So I have those. I have socks, hats, and then her ears in this one, and then some random bows. Um, this one, I just have random bows that like we don't really wear, and then her stuff that I like can't give up, like her baby hat and like memory stuff. Now, this drawer is kind of a mess, but what I have is like houseware stuff, so like any of this, this is like all onesies and stuff, and then some t-shirts, and then on this side, I have, this is all like her pajamas, so like organized like a little bit, but yeah. Also, a good hack, if you have a baby and your baby's super tall and not really like thick, um, what I did... What I did was, this sounds crazy, but I cut the bottoms out because these fit her. Like, I swear these fit her. It's just she's tall. So, and they were like squeezing her foot. So I just cut them and she loves them. I mean, I could definitely buy new pajamas, but these are so cute and they're so comfy now. And then, yeah, so that's what I did with a lot of her pajamas. So I just cut the bottoms out because she doesn't really need to sleep with her feet in. And here, this is kind of a mess also, but I have like house pants. This goes over there. I have jeans. We have shorts, shorts, new shorts, house pants. I'm like trying to organize as I go. Skirts. She just, this girl has so many clothes than I have. And then she also has like a full closet. So, okay, that's pretty organized to me. There. Okay, that's for the most part organized. Down here, I still have the 
this used to be diapers like our extra diapers which I still kind of have um, but now it's just blankets and sheets and then in this drawer her swimwear she has so much more so many more swimsuits she just wears them literally every single day and then her closet is a mess also but basically why is this there I don't even know why this is there. She was supposed to wear this the other day. Basically, I never hung up my blinds that I was supposed to hang up. Extra diapers. This is kind of like a storage room, too. Um, extra diapers, some books that she's too little, swim diapers. This is just a box that has my lap or my computer in it because it's shattered. And then her strollers, this old photo. It's just like a mess in here, so I think I want to organize it like a little bit better. The thing is, I use the stroller a lot, and we go on walks a lot, so I really need to give this back or donate that stroller. And then I also need to donate this high chair, because we don't use a high chair. We, have, we now have this, which 100% recommend. It's so easy to clean, and it's like amazing, and it doesn't take up too much space. My favorite thing in the world is when people come in and they're like, wait, you have a kid? I'm like, yeah. Because my house, I feel like it's just not dirty. Like, it just doesn't have a lot of kid stuff. Like, her stuff is here, but it's organized and it's, like, in a place. You know? Let's clean the closet. They did just redo my floors in my apartment. Um, glue was coming up from the, like, not cracks, but, like, the seams of my wood floors. And I just found two piles of, like, wet glue in the nursery closet. It's, like, right here and right here. So I just put in a work order. I'm going to put all of, like, the floor mats um, on the side and hopefully they'll fix it um, but uh, yeah I'm still gonna organize in here I move the diapers up there and let's move the rest of the floor and clean up <laughs> I don't know what just happened but I think I just stepped on something in the floor and it just came out more glue like what the heck that's a huge amount of glue and they didn't even fix in here okay finished so this is what her closet looks like now I'm going to eventually break this one down so I can give myself a little bit more room but I obviously need them to fix the glue situation before I kind of do anything but yeah it's not great up there but it'll do for the Everly stuff we love all of it that's not love Everly, but it's cool because each of the boxes has this like little guide and stuff she loves all of this and all of the boxes we have we will put in the down box below so you can get them look who's home crazy girl Crazy girl, crazy girl, crazy girl. You wanna go see your room? Yeah? No, come here. Come see your room. Come here, I know, I redid it. I redid it for you. Open it, go look. Go see. on you say I am 14 months my favorite thing to do is read books favorite movie is Moana favorite food is pasta huh favorite food is pasta what else do you love you love to go swimming we're in the pool every single day almost or at the beach Moo -moo. see I am very tall what else do you love I love my books I love my mommy 
See, I can say dog. Hi, Minnie. Hi, Mickey. And I love Disney World. Do you love Disney? And say I'm not scared of characters anymore. Huh? Oh, hi, Mickey. Hi, Minnie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you love it? I'm so happy, Mimi. <laughs> Anyways, guys, that is it for today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.